Hello friends, I'm Titus Nelson with Cat6 Tools and I'd like to introduce you to our cyclonic vacuum buckets. We originally developed these vacuum buckets to work with our holy moly post hole diggers. What this allowed us to do was to put a pre-filter in front of shop vacuums in order to collect the heavier materials, gravel, uh, rock, sand, even wet materials that uh, might be slurries with water. It turned out that these buckets worked extremely well and the beauty of them is, is that they would only be uh, up to say five gallons and so the weight would not be excessive and you could then uh, transport, carry the buckets a short distance to dump them out or in the case of collecting uh, hazardous materials, uh, we were able to then seal the bucket without any problem in order to transport. We make two types of uh, buckets. One is steel bucket and one is plastic with the cyclonic uh, inlet. The gamma lids, they easily uh, unscrew uh, off of the adapter that goes onto a bucket. This consists of a steel plate with uh, uh, stainless steel uh, hardware to uh, prevent corrosion, and we have two deflectors. These deflectors mounted on these uh, water jet or laser jet uh, cut plates uh, deflect the, the uh, air and materials uh, into a circular motion which then provides you your cyclonic action and it works exceptionally well. Working with our holy moly diggers uh, out in the field and with a rigid shop vacuum we found that we were collecting uh, uh, like 98 percent of the material into the bucket. Uh, then it was very easy to transport and we rarely had to clean the filters of the shop vacuum and it was a much much easier to uh, to empty the uh, uh, pails or the buckets. So we carried that a little further because of the uh, demand that we had for these things when they saw them in some of our videos. So what we did is we made a commercial version of it. So on the plastic bucket with the gamma lid uh, shown here uh, with the screw on lid. Now the beauty of that is, is that you can pull off the, the cyclonic lid and screw on a standard uh, gamma lid that you could pick up at the hardware store to seal it. Or you can just uh, unscrew the lid, dump your bucket and uh, put your lid back on and keep going. So that worked very well. On the, uh, we were looking for a little lower cost unit uh, that we could provide customers and we came up with a, a steel pail and the uh, steel lid and you can see that uh, all we had to do was just drill several, several holes and it was much easier to fabricate this. Uh, this works extremely well in your house uh, let's say that you got some flooding in your house and you didn't want to put your water into your shop vac uh, or you have a, a built-in vacuum system in your house, uh, this worked really good. Just hook your vacuum up to the uh, one port and use your uh, short hose on the other and you could suck up water and then it's easy to go dump it in the sink or uh, outdoors. And so this works very well. Uh, in addition to uh, these uh, cyclonic lids, we found that uh, if we used a higher flow rate, low resistance vacuum hose, that we could improve the performance of our shop vac by 20%. This is actually a major, especially when you're, you're dealing with uh, materials like gravel and rock and things like that. With our uh, rigid shop vac, we were pulling uh, a pound a second uh, through these hoses. And uh, it just did exceptionally well. And then what we did is we made our own connectors, which are uh, uh, real nice and they, th they screw on, thread onto the hose. And uh, these 
uh, adapters are made to go right inside of either one of the inlet or outlet. Uh, they're both the same on, on these cyclonic units. So uh, makes it very easy. It's an extremely good fit and a uh, good vacuum. And that gives you good, good flow rate. And finally, I'd like to tell you a little bit about uh, working in water. Uh, these work exceptionally well in, uh, in a wet environment, keeping your shop vac that would be electric uh, away from the water. And you can suck up some pretty uh, wet materials into the, uh, into the cyclonic buckets. And uh, for floods, I'll tell you, this bucket's your flood buddy. It is just amazing on how easy it is to then transport that material, say, out of your house. Uh, nothing like cleaning up water with a vacuum. Uh, I think shop vacs are probably one of the best uh, tools for uh, working in a wet environment. Uh, and that's, that's why they have wet dry vacs. So uh, I encourage you to look at the cyclonic buckets. Uh, once you use one, you'll, uh, you'll swear by it and keep it around. So now these are made for commercial uh, heavy duty work, mainly because that's what we used them for. These are not uh, inexpensive by any means, and uh, they're not to replace uh, what you might buy for just sawdust in a shop. These are high quality, made, made to last a long time units. And that's why we have a sticker on here, uh, which is very unique. These are made in the USA. And uh, we also have our logo on here, the Holy Moly Digger uh, logo. And uh, that, that gives you an idea of the quality for uh, working in uh, a uh, outdoor dirt, rock, sand environment. So enjoy these products that are made in the USA by Cat6 Tools.